Well, I've got a first impression for you guys of the Wet n Wild Color Icon Bronzer in Bronze Dynasty. <coughs> This is a first impression not only of the shade, but also of the formula because this is a brand new formula. This is from their Fire Dragon versus Ice Dragon, whatever it is, collection. Um, I really like how the packaging has the bronzy color. I'm hoping, like how they originally did with the Mega Glow highlighters, that they will have these as limited for this collection and then bring them out permanent and other shades later on if they sell well. So, yeah, I got this one based on the swatches they showed on Instagram. This was the lightest shade, so you can see it here. And I love the dragon design that is on it. I think it's just beautiful. I, unfortunately, was not able to get my hands on the bronzer brush that came with this collection. I'm still hoping to if Wet n Wild ever, not Wet n Wild, well, if Wet n Wild or Ulta ever get it back in stock. But I like using a brush like this because I don't use bronzer as like an all over type thing I tend to do it just as a stark contour so I like a brush like this it's the wet n wild p50 yeah this is the wet n wild p50 I'll try to link this down there you can find it pretty easy um but I do really like this one so <coughs> let's see what we got so I got a bit of a cough don't you yeah, I need to drink some water. Okay. So first thing I'm noticing is I do not have to be how, be careful with how much of this I'm getting on my brush. It's very light. It's um not overly powdery. Hmm. Let me grab. Sorry, I should have grabbed all of this before I started, but <coughs> they're um Mega Glow contouring palette. This, I have to like barely touch my brush to it because it's very powdery and I'll get way too much, way too easy. But this, I can get my brush in there and get how much I need. <coughs> Which do you prefer? This, because if you were using it as a true bronzer, not just a contour, um... It would work really well for that. I like this, and I like this shade for my paleness very well. Okay. Yeah, because this looks a lot more natural than a lot of the bronzers that I get as contouring. Um, it looks in the pan like it has a little bit of a sheen, but I'm not seeing that on my skin. <coughs> I don't know if you can see the contour, but I really like it. I put my highlight a little too high, but I really like this. I would recommend checking it out. Um, and I do hope they keep this as a permanent because this is really nice. Like, this is great for my really pale skin. So, yeah, if you have any experience with this, questions, comments, or opinions, as usual, throw those down in the comments. I would love to see how this worked for your skin, if you try different shades, if you have different skin tone than me. Otherwise, don't forget to subscribe. <coughs> I have done um, first impressions of other things from this line, and I do a lot of wet and wild first impressions on colors and stuff. So don't forget to check those out and um, my haul I did when I got this. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.